What's going on everyone? Derek Monster back in with the video. Today I'm going to Wendy's. So I'm going to Wendy's to try their ghost pepper chicken sandwich. I've been very hesitant to try this chicken sandwich because I don't know how my stomach's going to handle it because my spice torrents isn't what it used to be since I've been sick. But uh, I'm going to try it either way and we'll just see how my stomach handles it. But yeah, I'm going to head to Wendy's and I'll see you when I get there. Okay guys, I made it to Wendy's. This is actually a different Wendy's that I usually go to, but apparently this one's better. But yeah, I'm gonna hit the drive through and get my food. Hi, welcome to Wendy's, how can I help you? Hi, could I get your ghost pepper ranch chicken sandwich? Ghost pepper chicken, anything else? Uh, could I get that as a combo? Yeah, what's your name? Uh, just the water. Anything else? And that'll be it. Alright, that'll be $28.69, thank you. Thank you. Okay guys, I'm back from Wendy's. I have my food. I have my ghost pepper ranch chicken sandwich. I said ghost pepper in the intro, but I meant ghost pepper ranch. I forgot the ranch was part of it um, because it has ghost pepper ranch sauce on it. I'm pretty sure. I also have um, some fries just in case I'm still hungry. And I might not eat the whole ghost pepper sandwich if it's like too spicy or whatever. But yeah, that's what I got there. There's some stuff with some fries in the bag. I'll put those down put them my fry thing and then I also got a water just in case you know um, let's move these napkins over here and let's put my water on and on it so it's closer to the thing but yeah let's open this and then we'll get a close-up of it oh I can smell it oh there it is that's what it looks like but yeah let's get close up with this Okay guys, so here's the ghost pepper ranch chicken sandwich. It says on the website that it's got three layers of ghost pepper heat. So we got the bun and underneath we got ghost pepper ranch sauce, which is pretty good. We also got tomato, lettuce, under lettuce. We got ghost pepper fried onions and then ghost pepper American cheese, I believe. And then we got the spicy chicken patty and then underneath we just got the other bun. But yeah. I'm excited to try this. This looks pretty good and it's, it smells spicy. And I just licked some sauce off my finger and it's spicy. But they also have ghost pepper ranch fries. But I heard that those are spicier than this. So I thought I should try this first. But yeah, let's get into trying this. Okay guys, let's get into trying this. Let me pull my thing out and uh, move my uh, chicken sandwich in there. Let me kind of reposition because chicken's kind of falling off. I'm very hesitant to try this. I don't know how spicy it's gonna be, but we're just gonna try it anyway. I'm gonna bite in right there. Whew. Let's hope I don't fucking die from this. <laughs> but yeah, let's go. Mm. So far, it just tastes like a chicken sandwich. Oh, I'm getting some heat now. Okay, let's have another bite. Okay. Yeah, it's heating up. Mmm. <clears throat> oh. oh. Some heat just came up when I burped. Ah. Uh, Who? Okay. I will say, I anticipated to it be hot, but honestly, I thought it would be hotter because ghost peppers are like the second hottest pepper in the world. 
So I thought it was going to be a lot hotter, but it's not actually ba that bad. That's what it looks like. I think after a while, I'll get used to it. Mmm. Going through all my napkins. Thankfully, sometimes when I go to fast food restaurants, I get extra napkins. So I always have extra napkins here on my desk. Mmm. But yeah, it's pretty good. Mmm. I'm so glad Wendy's changed their fries to hot and crispy because now they're a lot better in my opinion. You know, they're actually kind of like salted and they're more crispy instead of flimsy. We still get flimsy fries here and there, but I feel that's like true for a lot of places. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, I feel like if you have any heat, you just did heat. It's just, I feel like that's true with a lot of things. It's like I don't realize how hot it is until I try it, and then I'm like, oh, you know, I need something to cool it down. And then I get used to it, and it's like, oh, I can I do this. Oh, it's like my body's saying that it w it's not used to it because it hasn't had it in a while. But yeah, honestly, I thought it was going to be hotter. I was hesitant because I don't know. Well, one, I was hesitant because when I was sick, I couldn't have chicken. And if I ever had chicken, you know what? It feel well. Ooh. I hiccup with them. Some like ghost pepper onion came up. Um, but while I was sick, I couldn't have chicken. And if I had chicken, it upset my gastritis, which was not a good thing. But after like three months, it like was healed because I didn't have any of that. I didn't know until like almost a year later that I had gastritis you know so every time I had chicken it would just make me upset and you know I just had that feeling of just being like I'm gonna throw up I'm gonna throw up I'm gonna throw up you know in bed but um yeah so I'm hesitant still to try chicken just because it was a bad experience for me that was a year-long thing or over a year-long thing um so it was kind of just a bad experience for me so that's why I was hesitant and then like spicy things peppers have citric acid in them. and uh, my stomach couldn't handle spicy things anymore like I tried a few times to have spicy things and it's just like sometimes my stomach just couldn't handle it um, but yeah anyway I feel like I'm good now I'm just hesitant on trying some stuff here and there um, but that's a little inside you know I kind of have to like Psychologically, tell like it's gonna be okay. I don't have this. I don't have gastritis anymore. It's gonna be okay. I'll be able to handle it. You know. But yeah, the ghost pepper ranch chicken sandwich. It's pretty good. Um, it's been out for quite a while now. I just didn't get the chance to try it until now. Um, it's probably been out for like a month or two, I would s assume. So it might not be much longer until it's gone. And maybe I'll go back to Wendy's to try their ghost pepper ranch fries. You know. Um, hopefully before they're gone too. I still want to go back to Arby's and try their deluxe bacon ranch Wagyu steakhouse burger but there's so many things I want to try and with my new thing of going to fast food restaurants once a week don't know if I'll be able to try some of these things that I want to try but yeah either way Ghost Pepper Ranch chicken sandwich pretty good definitely recommend you guys check it out for yourself if you haven't already especially if you like the heat because it's a pretty decent amount of heat you know maybe try the Ghost Pepper Ranch fries as well but yeah yeah, it's pretty good. Definitely recommend you guys check it out for yourself. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Stay safe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.